Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be doing a taste test review of the Milka Alpine Milk Chocolate Bar. Now this is a special kind. It's not made in Canada or America like some of the ones that I do on this channel. This is made in Germany, I believe. I got the Canadian sticker over it saying what the calories are, but for half the bar, there's 260 calories, 14 grams of fat, 30 carb with 30 sugar and 4 grams of protein. And yeah, this is a really good one. I've had it before and I've liked it. So sustainably sourced cocoa in this Alpine milk chocolate. I'm going to get right into it here and let you guys know what I think. If I can get into it. <laughs> it's got an intense wrapper. <laughs> oh my goodness. Usually chocolate is not this difficult to get into, but milk is doing it differently. Oh, come on. I can't rip too hard because I just had a few surgeries, <laughs> so I don't want to re-injure that. But here we go. Comes in little pieces like that. That's good. Real authentically chocolate flavor. Not too sweet. Tastes like real chocolate. Like cocoa. Not as sugary as some other chocolate bars out there. I think we'd appreciate that. Still has 30 grams, but doesn't taste as sugary. I'll finish that off there. You can taste the milk in it. Very interesting. Ingredients there. That's an interesting one. It has a real taste of chocolate, but it's not the chocolate you know. It's not the sugary, over sweetened tasting stuff that you can get at the store. It's more of a, it tastes more like milk, milk chocolate. It's good though. So the milk of chocolate on a scale of 110, I give that like an 8 out of 10. It's a nice switch up from the regular chocolates out there that taste very sugary. This one is not as sugary. But it's still very good. So if you're looking to switch it up, I'd definitely try this one. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe button below. And I'll see you in the next video.